Today we're gonna talk about the clown, I mean best friend in Persona 3, Junpei Iori. Known as the comedic relief of the group, he's a fellow recruited CS member, plus he's got a killer girlfriend. With that, here are my reasons why Junpei Iori is the man material. Spoiler warning for the Persona 3 story. I'm the man! Appearance wise, he's the only CS member that actually has some facial hair. He can usually be seen wearing the standard school uniform, except that he's wearing a blue shirt, fancy belt, and his signature baseball cap. Unique to Junpei is his love for spooky ghost stories. Hosting his very own Junpei's Believe It or Don't. And as everyone knows, Yukari isn't a fan. Greetings from the land of dreams, and welcome to Junpei's Believe It or Don't. There are many strange things in this world. You know what'll happen if you keep this up, right? Okay, okay. Let's not turn this into Junpei's bloodbath and demise. Just one of those few things that Junpei and Yukiko have in common. Speaking of ghost stories, wanna see something really scary? How about Junpei in a dress? Oh god, no. Like most teenage boys, Junpei has a messy room that can only be described as a pig's tie. It once got so bad that Mitsuru even involved the authorities. My room always looks like this. You can't possibly live here in this state, can you? I think this case is closed. May I return to my duties, Miss Kirijo? Uh, yes. I'm sorry you had to see something so disgraceful. In Persona 3 Dancing, Elizabeth, or should I say LP, decided to recreate everyone's personal room as their designated resting area. The waiting rooms appear to be adjacent, but they are separate and completely soundproof. Be reassured that you can bang all you want in there, no problem. Somehow, she was able to capture the mess that is Junpei's room. At first glance, it may seem cluttered, but every piece of junk has been precisely placed. No expense was spared in simulating Junpei's amazingly untidy and irresponsible lifestyle. As mentioned by LP, everything's recreated down to the finest detail, and yes, even the goods under the futon. Take the books kept under the bed filled with pictures of women. Due to the large variety of images, it was a monumental task to reproduce each one. Female doctors, nurses, flight attendants, some even involving masks and ropes. Wow. As a best friend, Junpei's pretty all right. You can tell he's a real guy's guy. Hey, uh, by the way, are you going out with Fuka? No worries, that's cool with me. Fuka's a great girl. In an alternate dimension, while playing as FemC, Junpei knows someone snapping a pic of us and vows to catch the guy. The next time we see him, he has a black eye after taking a punch to the face. He did this all just to get rid of the photo, showing that Junpei can be quite a gentleman, which will be important for this next bit. Back to the blue-haired universe, early in the story, Junpei declares himself to be a total expert on women, despite seeing him and Akihiko fail time and time again on the beach. As most people can tell, Junpei is kinda delusional when it comes to women. Quite often, you'll see him ogling the very seas girls. He once pointed out Fuka's figure, which didn't end too well for him, and when Mitsuru came out, he couldn't keep his eyes off her. And in the case of Yukari, he playfully hits on her as if he's even got a shot. We're talking about me here! Junpei, ace protective! My presence puts you at ease. If you're afraid of ghosts, Yukatan, I could stay close and comfort you while you sleep. Fortunately, Yukari isn't afraid to retaliate. <sighs> Do people remember pain after they wake up from a dream? Let's find out, shall we? Junpei at times likes to brand himself as a detective. Yo, Yukatan. This is a tough case, even for Junpei Iori, Ace Detective. Ace Detective? More like Stupei Ace Defective. Oh! During the events of Persona 3 Dancing, he didn't hesitate to comment his feelings about LP. Whatever, she's such a hottie. You know her. And let's not forget that time he tried to hit on Aegis. My name's J J Junpei. Ju Ju Junpei? I am looking for a human. You are not the one. Despite his silly antics, I have to give Junpei some credit for being loyal to Chidori. That's his killer girlfriend I mentioned earlier. By being his natural self around her, he was able to break down the barrier and get on her good side. And when he acquired her sketchbook, he found a beautiful sketch of himself, showing how much he affected her. In fact, when he was a pro baseball player, he even proposed to her during his victory speech. Hey, is there anyone who'd like to dedicate this victory to? I'd like to dedicate that grand slam to my precious girl who's always supported me through thick and thin. Will you marry me? <laughs> Too bad it was just a dream. In combat, he wields a simple longsword and fills the role of the fire user of the group. With Evoker, he uses it to summon his persona, Hermes, the god of swiftness. However, this isn't his final form yet. During the epic battle with Chidori, Junpei is fatally shot by Takaya. So in order to save him, Chidori gives him her Spring of Life ability, thus reviving him, 
but in exchange for hers. Yet another truly tragic moment in the Persona 3 story. Poor Junpei. At this point, Takaya lets out a careless comment. Oh, what a pity. Such a meaningless death. This then causes Junpei to awaken to his final persona, Trismegistus, and he's packing heat. <laughs> Somehow, he just obliterated a guy that's supposed to repel fire damage. Junpei has the strange ability to endure all sorts of abuse, such as taking full-on punches, getting smacked by shadows, and taking an epic slap from Makoto. And with the addition of Chidori's Spring of Life ability, Junpei is able to restore some HP each turn, which makes him quite the man in terms of physical attackers. Now in terms of Junpei's dancing, he's not the most technical, but he certainly has some radical dance moves. Wait, is that a baseball bat? As you'll notice, Junpei's dance alpha is certainly out of this world. On top, he wears a Space Galaxy shirt along with a backwards cap and blue wristband. Next, he seems to be wearing the typical black school pants along with some green and blue kicks. You'll also notice that he's wearing the school jacket around his waist, which for some reason is lime green on the inside. Well, me being a perfectionist, I'm having a hard time making creative decisions. So in this scenario, Mitsuru had the honor to critique the great Junpei. I'm not sure I'm the one to ask, but I'll see what I can do. All right, here goes. This is pose number one. Viva! Okay, now for pose number two. Here goes. Who's the man? Is something wrong with my eyes? Both poses looked exactly the same to me. I think I like pose number two better. It's at this point that Mitsuru commends our synergy. Oh, you think so? Well, I guess we've been through a lot together. Yo, that hurts! I've been working really hard to change my ways, you know? Well, this is humble for the moment. Going to our conversation with Fuka. You've never looked better, Junpei-kun. You're like a professional dancer. It really doesn't help when she butters him up like that. Like I said, Junpei can be humble at times. I've learned to put my all into things that matter and not be half-assed about them. I changed after watching you guys. I'm thankful for that, even if I don't show it. That was good, right? What'd you think? Didn't it sound like an actual documentary? Well, that didn't last long. Something that Sweeps can relate to is the fact that Junpei is an avid manga reader. You ever read Fist of the South, Paul? Loser hero in a post-apocalyptic setting? It's the one part of the room that he kept organized. And he was nice enough to lend it to Ken, filling in that big brother role. Now let's move to his conversation with Aegis. Very well. I will get straight to the point. Your dancing is excellent, Junpei-san. It is a lot of fun to watch. I guess don't encourage him. Ah, oh, thanks, Ai-chan. That's what a star is supposed to do. We should all be grateful to him. Don't you agree? Uh, can I say no? Dude, take a hint. You just ruined the moment. <laughs> so what do you think about Junpei? Would you want to have him as your best friend? Be sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment about Junpei Iori, our favorite ace defective.